one of the last times that you guys were in this talk, you were you were the quarterback. What are your thoughts on being ranked 16th in the college football playoff standings? You know, obviously, it's uh, it's always nice to be recognized for your work, but at the end of the day, I mean, we've got uh, a long way to go to finish the season. You know, and and it's. You know, with those early buys, you know, we're one game behind everybody and, and we got four more weeks to, you know, to grind out. And, and, you know, we've been playing better by latching on to what coach has been telling us about one play at a time. And our guys have, um, you know, have adopted that mantra and, and played with that mindset. And and us coaches have tried to do the same thing. And, mm-hmm. and so, uh, you know, there'll be time to look back and, see how it all goes to to be able to make those uh, kind of comparisons for us but right now truly it's it's one play at a time for us as a staff as well you've been on the other end I mean as a player being able to find that groove and hit that groove you know what that feels like what's it feel like being a coach and seeing this team rattle off three straight rounds very similar you know it's exciting and 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 more than anything I think just the improvement that we've been able to make I mean it's uh, you know, it gives you a little bit of momentum. It, it gives our guys a little bit more confidence and, and familiarity with our schemes and how we do things. And, and uh, you know, it's exciting. It's a lot of fun. And, and even though there's going to be ups and downs in that journey, uh, getting better and accomplishing something is, is very rewarding. And that's what I think our guys have gotten a little bit of a taste of. And, and uh, you know, we just got to keep it up. Because like I said, we got a long way to go. How have you seen Skyler improve as a runner this season? You know, I think uh, um, I, I think just time and understanding how different schemes happen and, and the timing of, of the blocking schemes and learning when to be patient and learning when to press and, and, and all those things. I think there's a, a tactical growth that, that's obviously happened. I think, um, I think too, just his overall um, approach, you know, his, his confidence, his um, – you know, has shown up in the run game as well, you know, and, and, and we've been able to get him in some space too, you know, and, and he's got it, gotten himself in some space, whether it be on scrambles or, you know, on the edge with the speed option stuff or, or whatever it's been, uh, you know, having a little success and getting in, in the open field, you know, helps, helps you run better too. When so you, when you look at the body of work with, with Skyler, and I know you can appreciate this being on all the, all the lists, but um, just his role as, as a, dual threat quarterback and be able to do what it takes when the team needs it. I mean, it's it's been huge. I mean, obviously we've relied on it on, you know, in third down and in the red zone and 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 he's taken that responsibility seriously and, and mindset of, you know, hey, we got to find a way to get it done, you know, and, and he's uh, he's answered the bell that way. It's given us a boost. So much of, you know, what he's done has been based around carrying the football here lately. How much can you help him as a guy that took a lot of hits in, in your career to kind of learn when to go down, when to get out of bounds, and how to avoid, yeah. you know, Play so much fast time. is the best advice, I, you know, and, and ultimately, if you start thinking about it too much, you know, you're, you're going to get yourself potentially hurt more. Um, it's something you got to, you know, I tell them sometimes I feel like I'm a, uh, you know, great coach by saying just trust your instincts. You know, it's nothing super scientific of, hey, you know, you're in a situation and things are happening so fast, you got to trust your instincts and, and do the best you can and, and get your pads down and split two and and, and get as much as you can, but obviously not, uh, you know, being silly about it either. And it's it's a fine line. You mentioned yesterday that he felt like maybe his running, uh, his skills running <coughs> football maybe fit better in this offense than maybe they did a year ago. Have, have you seen him a little bit more comfortable running the ball in this in this new offense? Um, you know, I think so. I think again, we've, uh, uh, <clears throat> I think we've uh, we've been able to use it a little bit more hit or miss. You know, so that we're we're a little bit maybe less predictable. You know, in some situations with it. Um, like I said, I think getting him getting him in some space has helped give him some confidence too. With uh, <clears throat> you know some of the zone read stuff on the edge, some of the speed option stuff, and then some of the draw stuff is um, you know has not been as much power run game you know with the quarterback type of a thing and, and a few things like that i think have helped give him confidence i think of uh uh you know and, and he's done a good job of it so do, do you anticipate the speed option working as well as it did on saturday over and over um you, you know i, I knew we were going to get some looks for it you know i didn't know how long they'd be there or um 
you know, but our guys had executed it well and, and uh, you know, we, we were able to get the looks we anticipated and, and credit to them and Skyler and uh, Harry. I mean, the, uh, the execution was was good, you know, and it's something we got to keep keep doing. It's, uh, you know, it's something we practice, you know, quite a bit, you know, respectively. You know, you don't get a lot of team reps, but uh, the fundamentals of it, it's not something you can just say, hey, pick up, let's try it. <laughs> you know, it's, it's something you got to work on and, and Skyler's done a good job with it. and. Uh, has given me and obviously Coach Messingham, you know, mainly the confidence to put it on the field.